<laughs> What's up YouTube, Sabo Drew here and welcome back to another video from the Tony Awards. Today we're going to be reacting to Brotherhood of Man from How to Succeed in Business. So this was a recommendation from one of the comments in the last video and I decided I'm going to do these one-offs basically until I finish Hamilton and then we'll move on to a different theatrical play and um, I'll probably have a vote for that somewhere and you guys can all vote on what you would like to see next and I plan on finishing Hamilton this month. So until then we're going to do these little one-offs from different theatrical performances or musicals. Um, so. I wanted to know a little bit more about this before we start it. It's originally from 1961. So it was a revival here in this video. And it's from, it's based off of a book, okay? And it's from, oh, let's see, 1952. A high rise window washer becomes the chairman of the board. Okay, that's pretty impressive. Originally starring Robert Morris and Rudy Vallee, opened at the 46th Street Theater on Broadway, 1961, running for over 1,400 performances. That seems pretty significant. The show won seven Tony Awards, the New York Drama Critics Circle Award, and the, which is what, by the way, can somebody confirm what that is for me? And because I can't click on it, and the 1962 Pulitzer Prize for Drama. Okay, 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 cool. And in 1995, it was revived. Really cool, okay. 548 performances, so not nearly as long. Probably, yeah, 50th anniversary Broadway revival directed and choreographed by Rob Ashford, starring Daniel Rad Radcliffe, yes, John Larroquette, all right. And opened in 2011 and it ran for 473, wow. No way. Okay, that is very interesting, you guys. All right, let's go ahead and check this one out. I hope you guys enjoy it. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. We would be glad to have you, and we can uh, do these more often. If you guys like them, just let me know down below in the comment section, and uh, I'll start cranking them out. I think it's fun, I think it's very interesting. I love theater and musicals. It's something that I've recently discovered on this channel. I'm happy to go forward with it. This channel is all about discovering new things, ideas, um, music, art, everything that I am not accustomed to that I want to open my mind up to and this would be one of those things that I want to get and to get to know and see more of. So happy to do it, you guys. All right, here we go. I know what's on your mind. You'd like to clear out the whole crowd from top to bottom. But before you consider firing Mr. Bigley. Whoa, whoa, who's considering that? I would like to say a few words. About what? Humanity. Now you may join the Elks, my friend, and I may join the Shriners, and other men may carry cards as members of the diners. Still others wear a golden key or small Greek letter pin. But I have learned there's one great club that all of us are in. There is a brotherhood of man, a benevolent brotherhood of man, a noble tie that binds all human hearts and minds into. You can tell that the um the arrangement of the song and the sound and like the uh the harmony of it is very oldies style and it's really really nice actually a lot of the songs or ambient noises that i listen to are oldies music and stuff like that oldies from another room or um you're in your bedroom staring out your window oldies music in the background stuff like that so I think this would be something that I actually really enjoyed. The original, even, I think. Not just the, the um, revival versions. 
one brotherhood of man. Your lifelong membership is free. Keep forgiving each brother all you can. Oh, aren't you proud to be in that fraternity? <laughs> Daniel Radcliffe right, with the moves. Oh my! No kidding. Is the really a brotherhood? Yes. Oh my gosh. Wow. Um, first of all, all of the voices coming together like that sound really amazing. But can we appreciate the nimbleness of all these gentlemen on this stage in suits, doing flips, splits, dives, whatever all of that just was? Impressive. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, they're really feeling it now. You can see the confidence is at an all time high. They are smashing this. <laughs> Stand up. Stand up. Are you kidding? That was amazing. <laughs> that was very um choreographed so to speak. yeah that was there was so much choreography involved and it just kept getting louder and more energized and vibrant throughout the entire thing and by the end like i said they were really feeling it you could tell like they were very confident in that i feel like it got better as it went on but that was a lot of choreography i feel like and to maintain that level of connection and um togetherness that entire time that was very impressive wow that was really good you guys let me know what you think of this one and by the way this is from 2011 tony awards 65th annual tony awards 2011 
That was really good. Whoever recommended this, I can't remember your name. Thank you. I really enjoyed that. Daniel Radcliffe actually also surprised me as well. I did not know that he was in theater. So amazing. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't yet and leave a like on your way out. But I just want to thank you guys for watching this with me and have a good weekend. Until next time, peace. Thank you.